Guys, today I will show how to make a 12 volt auto cut off charger with full charge alarm. For that first we need a 12 volt relay. Let's apply little solder on pins of relay. Take 1N4007 rectifier diode. Solder diode with coil pins of relay, with diodes cathode side up. Bend the diodes cathode pin, and solder with com pin of relay. Take BC547 or BC548 transistor. Solder collector of transistor with diodes anode side. Take 10 kilo ohms resistor. Solder on diodes anode pin. Take 2.2 kilo ohms resistor. Solder between base of transistor and 10k resistor. Now take 470 ohms resistor and solder on emitter of transistor. Take 180 ohms resistor and solder between 10k resistor and 470 ohms resistor. Take a green LED Solder LED positive with normally closed pin of relay. And take a red LED. Solder LED positive with normally open pin of relay. Connect negative pins of both LEDs. Now take 1 kilo ohms resistor. Solder on negative pins of both LEDs. Take a 12 volt buzzer. Solder buzzer positive with green LED positive and buzzer negative with 1K resistor. Connect a jumper wire between buzzer negative and emitter of transistor. Take ASR360 short key diode. Solder anode on normally open pin of relay. Now take two wires. Solder input positive with COM pin of relay. And solder input negative with emitter of transistor. Take crocodile clip wires. Solder output negative with same emitter of transistor. And solder output positive with diodes cathode side. Here is the circuit diagram, download link is in description. Now our circuit is complete and ready to test. I will use multimeter to monitor the voltage. The input supply to the circuit should be fixed as 14.5 volts. Here I will use normal 8Ah battery, you can charge up to 100Ah battery but output diode should be replaced with 10 ampere diode. Connect circuit with battery. Also I connected multimeter with battery to track voltage. 
You can see battery is already charged to 12.48 volts. Let's connect input voltage with circuit. Now battery is charging, you can see voltage is slowly rising up. Now charging voltage has been cut off to battery at about 13.9 volts, and now battery is fully charged. I will disconnect input, and if I connect again the circuit won't allow to charge battery as it is already fully charged. So, the circuit was very easy to make, I recommend to make it on zero PCB. If you enjoyed the video, share and hit the like button. For more videos, subscribe the channel, also check out these recommended videos. Thanks for watching.